Hey guys, if you're like me, then you like free software and there's a lot of cool programs out there that are absolutely free and they sometimes do the job just as well as paid programs. So I'm going to talk to you about five of my favorite free programs that you can download right now. Now the first one is an audio editor called Audacity. This is a really powerful audio editing program that lets you pretty much do whatever you want. It might not be as powerful as some of the heavy hitters like Cubase or Adobe Audition, but this is definitely something great for people who are starting out with audio editing. As a matter of fact, when I recorded one of my songs, the Valve software rap for my other channel, that's what I used to record from my microphone. So it can definitely cut it if you're looking for a high quality audio editing program. Now the second program also has to do with media. This is actually called VLC Media Player. This program can pretty much play whatever video, audio, file that you can think of. Any format, it can play pretty much every single one. I download it and I actually use it as my default media player because it's so simple and I never have to worry about getting the right codecs because it pretty much has them all. So I recommend checking this out if you ever have a video file that you can't play because you don't have the right codec or something like that. Check out VLC because I can pretty much guarantee it will be able to play that. There's a few exceptions of very obscure codecs that I haven't been able to play with that, but those are the rare exceptions. Now the third program has to do with security. It's actually Microsoft Security Essentials. This is my antivirus of choice and it's lightweight. I never know it's even there unless I want to do a virus scan. It's not intrusive, it doesn't take up resources, and it's actually really, really well rated. Last time I checked when it was pitted against some of the well-known antivirus softwares like Norton and Kaspersky, it did pretty well and definitely kept up to par with them. Now the fourth program is actually really cool. It has to do with storage on your hard drive. If you have ever wondered what's taking up all the space on your hard drive, this program called Windeer Stat can help you out with that. It basically gives you a visual view of all the files on your computer and arranges them by size. So you can see which files and programs are taking up the most space on your hard drive. I know there have been plenty of times where I've opened up Windarestat and saw that there was a huge data file that I wasn't even using and it was taking up half my hard drive. Obviously I'm exaggerating but you get the idea. I definitely recommend this program if you're ever running out of space on your hard drive. Now the fifth and final program is called Dropbox. You may have heard of it and it has to do with synchronizing files. I install this on all my computers and it's a godsend for when I have to save a paper or back up any type of file. Not very good for big files like movies, but for documents it's amazing because it can sync fast across all your computers. You know it's backed up, you don't have to worry about it. So I hope this list helped you guys find some interesting programs that you might like if you didn't know about these already. Thanks for watching and see you next week.